campaign 2016 now, presidential candidate Jeb Bush is heading back to school. The former governor is making a campaign stop right here in South Florida. CBS 4's Ted Scouten has the story live from the La Progressiva Presbyterian School in Miami. Ted? Hi, Ruta Bay and Walter. Well, Jeb Bush dubbed this a town hall meeting here at the school in Little Havana. He discussed everything from the deficit to immigration, but there was heavy focus on both education as well as his rival Donald Trump. Let's welcome Governor Bush, hopefully our next president of the United States. He may have been talking to high school kids, but Jeb Bush was definitely on the campaign trail. I'm excited about being a candidate for president to to talk about these things, about how we need to lift people up. While speaking to students at La Progresiva Presbyterian School, Bush talked up his years as governor, especially his program, allowing kids to choose private schools over public. When I was governor, when I got there, 1999, a long time ago, we were 50th out of 50 in terms of graduation rate. Because of the efforts of reform that we had, particularly school choice, we now have increased the graduation rate by 50%. During a town hall meeting with teens, Bush was asked about his views on immigration. Mi esposa, tengo el privilegio de estar casado con una mexicana. He took questions in Spanish, talked about his wife, who is from Mexico, and he wasted no time setting himself apart from frontrunner Donald Trump. He blasted the billionaire's plan for mass deportations and doing away with birthright. But I think that birthright citizenship is embedded in the Constitution of the United States. I've consistently said that. And Bush seemed very focused on setting himself apart from the front runner Donald Trump. Meanwhile, in a lighter moment, he took some time to take a selfie with the senior class. Live in Little Havana, Ted Scout, CBS 4 News.